Hey guys, how are you doing today? So I am finally back with another video. Let me apologize for the video quality because I am recording uh, with photo booth. You know, if y'all guys are um, Mac people, you know, photo booth, whatever. My phone's being a little bianch because um, <laughs> there's some more storage. So I'm recording with the phone booth. I don't know where I'm supposed to look at. If I look here at myself, am I looking at y'all guys? Do I have to look at the camera? I don't know. Um, I'm not going to turn this light on because it's really bright and it's hurting my eyeballs. It's not really meant for face lighting, it's more meant for reading. Um, I also want to apologize for my appearance because it's, it was very hot today and it was very hot at my work. And if y'all are from Germany, y'all do know that the Germans don't believe in air conditioning. I don't know why. They don't believe in it or maybe it's too much money. I don't know. I don't know, but we really don't have that much cold air in our building and then I went to go do back today and I did um, bike cycling today so anyways um, let me start off by saying hi to my new subscribers guys I think we're like at 302 oh my gosh we're growing um, I just want to say to my new subscribers if y'all have any video requests or um, comments definitely read them leave them in the bottom because I do read them and I read all the comments even if they're bad ones so you better watch what you're saying to me Anyway, so let's start off with the questions and comments, okay? So, Anthony Cropper, do you like boiled eggs? Tell us about boiled eggs that you eat. So, um, the only time I like eating boiled eggs is when they are in potato salad, mm, homemade potato salad, or in tuna fish. Like, I get tuna fish, I put them in a bowl, I cut the eggs, and I put them in tuna fish with mayonnaise and pieces of pickles, mix it, and put it on some toast bread. Mm. Okay. And Anthony Crawford, you asked that question like 10,000 times. You must have an obsession with eggs, maybe? Okay, so next person. Dreamstar, can you please make a reaction video on this ball busting contest video? I want to see your expressions. I will definitely do that in another video because this was just more for um, the people's questions and comments and things like that. Um, Nate K, I'm intrigued when it comes to piercings. It's like seeing a female version of me. Not only do we have our piercings at the same discreet spot because we do not need any, everybody to see, know about them, but we also like to stretch them. We even have the same size <gasps> kitty. We even have the same size tongue ring. This feels pretty weird. And just like someone mentioned previously, I can recommend bodyjulieshop.com or shop. Um, I have seen that website before and I love all their things and I'm just like, Later, a Bible later. Okay, Brenda Wahadro. I did hear, <laughs> just, just kidding, mom. That's my mom. Brenda Wahadro. I can never say that last name. That's her, that's her maiden name. I did hear, like, I did hear, like, if someone was walking up in the attic, no one, no one was, mom, you messed up. No one was, else was home. <laughs> what else could it be? Yup, ghost. So, one, if y'all remember, for y'all, my new subscribers, my mom was visiting me here in Germany, and uh, she went back home already. But she was staying in this room next door to me right here, and um, she was hearing someone walking upstairs in the attic. And we have a pretty big attic. I I definitely I want to do a like a home like my home type video, whatever the fuck you want to call that. What is it? My home video, and I'm um, show y'all guys because this attic goes like really. It's like upstairs could be like a, a home, and. Um, so anyways, she heard someone walking upstairs and she asked me, she could you message me at work? She's like, hey, um, was your husband home today? Was he in the attic? And I'm like, no, he was at work. Why? Why do you say that? She's like, because I heard someone walking upstairs. And I'm like, no, mom, we're all gone. Like, what the fuck? And I don't want to give into it because, like, you know how they say, like, if you hear something where you feel like something's really weird, just don't show it because it happens more. Anyways, that, that was another video of my house is haunted. If you want to see that video, go check it out because it's pretty creepy. Okay. Um, mama, 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 mama. Dream Star, could you please make a reaction video on this ball busting contest video? I want to see your expressions. I definitely will in another video, okay? Um, Mohad Azhar, Azor? Azor. Ooh, ooh, I got five kicks in my balls. Okay. Exploding Coconut, I fucking hate girls. I'll tell you why. It was three years ago, it was 2013, and I walked in New York City and there was a girl. I said, Excuse me. Can you move? And she turned around and kicked me in the balls and stomped on me. And she had a glass bottle and she threw it at me. So I was really bloody and my balls were crushed. And now I can't have kids because of those fucking bitch girls. I fucking hate them. I think I'm going 
kill myself. So don't kill yourself because there's a lot of children out there that um, need a really good home. And ooh, nice car. So anyways, um, there's a lot of children out there that need a really good home and you know, and I and I have a, a story to tell real quick if y'all guys didn't mind. I have a, a really old friend that told me a story that about he he basically would send cattle here and there. I don't know if people sold them or what, but he would put the cat the cattle in uh like you know like the 18 wheeler trucks. So he would put them in there and this one bull was being like a bitch and he didn't want to listen and he was like, you know, go on, go on, go and the bull just back kicked him and hit him crushed his nuts or some shit like that. I think he's, no, 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 he kicked him and that guy fell and the guy fell and the bull like stomped half on his thigh, half on his nuts or something like that. Yeah, so um, he was told he couldn't have kids. He has two kids now. So just give it a, tr just give it a chance to blow coconut. Sugar bean, hi love, I love the videos. Have you considered doing a live question and answer session? We love that. A live video? Um, yeah, I would think about it. Definitely would like to do it. Um, yes, okay. Um, Frederick Johansson, can you do a video where you show what tricks you can do with your tongue piercing? I think I already have a video. I think it's called Taking My Piercing Out or something like that. Something like that. But go check it out. Okay, Jason for Hoverus is a two. Thanks for answering my question. Check out the scary stories on my channel if you get bored. More to come. Okay. And Jason, you wrote a lot on my stuff, so I can't read all of them. It's not fair to the rest of the peoples. Kuzo28, if you listen to hip hop or grim, as they call it in the UK, woohoo! Listen to the Skepta, Skepta, and most importantly, Daps on the map with the song Oh My Days. Also, listen to the Deps, Deps Man sound mate. We've got Ozu. I definitely will check it out. Kyle got reviews. You look fine just the way you are. Don't let anyone tell you what you should or shouldn't do. Your body is yours and you can do whatever you want with it. Anyways, just uh, thank you for subscribing to me. And uh, again, like I said, if you have any video requests or if you have any comments, definitely put them in the bottom because I what? Read them. <laughs> um, Michael Brzezinski, you look like your early 20s, but but you are 30, so you are still young this year. Is your sister older or younger than you? My sister is three years younger. Three years, my baby. Um, we Blue Jones, ouch. It was weird that my balls actually kind of hurt while watching this. He was reacting to my uh, put you guys in the balls video, so. Jason for Hebrews 2. My username is Voorhees, as in the Friday 13 movie. Oh. And about my question, you should watch Giant Spider Invasion and Killer Clowns from Outer Space. No! I'm not going to watch that. Sounds scary. So Jason, you wrote a lot of stuff, but I can't read all of it because it's not fair to the subscribers, as I said before. Um, Nikki Hajasiski, sweetie. Yay me. Um, what? What happened? Oh. Uh, Dave Rush. Hey, Flack Butterfly, do you think your husband will ever accompany you in one of your videos? So he is actually away for business. Um, I asked him, so, but the, the bad thing about it, that he knows that if any of people watching, subscribers talk shit or want to say something mean, not, that, not anything's wrong with him, but you know, some, some people are just fucking assholes. They have like nothing else to do, so they'll talk shit. I will definitely just cut this YouTube channel off. I know it's not fair to my loyal subscribers, but I just don't want anyone constantly talking shit. So like I said, family always comes first. So. Dave Rush again. By the way, UFO doesn't necessarily mean alien, it's just an un unidentified flying object. At most, it was a secret military test. They've probably already designed many futuristic flying objects that are kept secret. I doubt aliens would waste their time with us anyway, just as we would not waste our time with ants. Oh wait, I guess we do study ants. Never mind. <laughs> um, so. The reason I did that because he puts a little spittle face in my face. Um, I think it was an alien, Dave, so I'll agree to disagree. <laughs> Damon Salvatore. Hi, pretty lady. I was going to call you Miss Flack or Madame or Madame Butterfly. Which do you prefer? I prefer none. Uh, if neither, I'll call you Goddess Flack of Fly. Or is that worse than the first two? It's kind of worse. <laughs> I love your videos and the one about your haunted house was a little scary, it gave me shivers. I saw an energy ghost spirit thing when I was young. Maybe I'll tell you the story one day. 
It was so real. Are you still going to... Are you still answering questions? By the way, if so, I know it isn't about boss, but I had a few experiences with my ex and also I was young um, and I was going to ask your opinion from a girl's point of view. Let me know in one of your next videos. By the way, does your name mean skinny butterfly or little butterfly? It's cute. So, oh, by the way, you can send me messages, guys. Um, sometimes I get them, sometimes I don't. Just write it here, okay? If not, I guess just send it to me. Um, my name is not Skinny Butterfly. It, this is not together. Flaca, it means skinny, and for a girl, Flaca or Flaco, it's boy. Um, I was always a petite person, so Flaca was given to me. And Butterfly is what my name means. So if you can figure out what Butterfly means and match it with the name, then you know my name. Because I haven't said my name on here yet, I don't think. Because people keep asking me, I just don't want to tell you because it's a secret. If you, if you were hooking up with a random guy and his dick was like one inch flaccid and dick was four inch hard, would you do? Would you laugh? Is it bad to have your balls be longer than your dick? I saw a video of a girl on YouTube saying when she, when she would grab her ex dicks, her ex dick, the tip would poke through her hand and she has small hands and she has her friends laughed. What are your thoughts? Can you do reply please? That's pretty fucked up. If you're gonna fucking do a video because your ex boyfriend had a small dick, who's the stupid one? And I'm not trying to say having a small dick is bad, but if you're talking shit, who's the stupid one? He was your boyfriend. You probably weren't good enough for him, sweetie, because you're going on YouTube wasting your time talking about someone's small dick. But so um, Keith Key six eighteen. I find that your video is most enlightening and honest. You're a great woman, and you also look great. And thank you. Anyways, guys, those were all y'all's questions and uh, comments. And again, to all my new subscribers and to my oldies, um, if y'all have, again, any video requests or comments, leave them in the bottom because I definitely read them. Um, I hope y'all guys all have a great day. Please, guys, do me a favor. Can y'all like my um, videos? And again, also do leave your comments. And please favorite these videos because that would make me so happy. Um, anyways guys, I love you guys so so much. I hope you all have a great day and I'll see you soon. Bye!